coral reefs support 25% of all marine life. They also help in coastal protection. They act as our first line of defense, protecting us from storm surge and flooding. Um, they also support 1 billion people as either revenue or food in over 100 nations across the planet. And science is actually 300 to 400 times more likely to find treatments to today's uh, illnesses and diseases from a coral reef because of the sheer biodiversity that exists in this ecosystem. And all of those reasons value coral reefs to be a conservative $2.7 trillion. For all of those reasons, we just cannot afford for a reef to die. I am a corn farmer and it's almost the same. I have a farm of, of animals and I'm trying to reproduce them to make more. Um, but in this case, we're trying to repair a degraded coral reef. Our pilot farm is located in my home, uh, Freeport, Grand Bahama. Um, this whole process starts off with first finding a degraded coral reef. We want to know what may have caused this reef to be degraded. Uh, the, the pressure or the stress still there, or is it gone? Um, then we go looking for what we call fragments of opportunity. Uh, corals are able to sexually reproduce, um, and they're also able to asexually reproduce. A coral can fragment and continue to grow. Granted, you know, they fall into a place that's conducive to growing. And so we would look for these fragments of opportunity, pieces of broken coral that may have fallen into a place where it can't grow. And we gather those up and we bring them back to the farm. They grow over those plugs. We place them onto a larger thing about this size. It's made of cement that we call a coral cookie. <laughs> and then we transplant those cookies back onto the reef to rehabilitate it. We won the Revive Our Oceans category, Earthshot Prize in 2021, which was an amazing gift by the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge to incentivize change um, on our planet. Um, we are moving on to our second stage. We have what we know that we need to build a farm. Now let's scale it up. And so the Earthshot Prize assisted us with starting that scaling up process and also looking for um, other countries or other nations to have coral vitas uh, around the world. Everyone can help protect coral reefs in many, many ways. We do have um, an adopt a coral program where you can go to the Corona website and actually um, adopt a coral. It's a 100% natural gift and it's a sustainable gift. And we launched on Valentine's Day and it's been received really well. And honestly, it's just so adorable to, to think that, you know, you've adopted this little baby coral and one day it's gonna link up with all of its buddies on a coral cookie <laughs> and then it's gonna be transferred onto the reef and grow, maybe not forever, but for a very, very long time. Oh.